On Thursday, 23rd of June, the people of the United Kingdom will vote to leave or remain in the European Union. With many voters still undecided, the outcome is hard to predict, but a Brexit is a real possibility. Many experts have warned of the possible negative effects of a Brexit for the UK, but many in Ireland are wondering, how would a Brexit affect us? As the UK's closest neighbour, Ireland will feel the effects of a Brexit more than any other country. The UK is Ireland's largest trading partner, with 1.2 billion euro in trade flowing across the Irish Sea every week. But if the UK leaves the EU, trade could fall by 20% or more. Customs posts could be re-established, slowing down the flow of trade and creating costs for business. Tariffs on goods would be imposed, which would mean higher prices for Irish consumers. Ireland also shares an all-island electricity market with Northern Ireland, which keeps energy flowing and prices low. But a Brexit could interfere with this energy market and increase prices for Irish households. Ireland and the UK also share a common travel area protected under EU treaties, which allows people from each nation to live and work freely in the other. Today, there are 331,000 Irish citizens living in the UK and 115,000 UK citizens living in Ireland. 30,000 people commute across the border to work every day. If the UK were to leave the EU, the future of the common travel area would be uncertain. Irish people in the UK might lose their special status, and it could also result in passport controls at the Irish-UK border. Peace and stability in Northern Ireland are important for Ireland and the UK. Common membership of the EU has encouraged dialogue between the two nations and has provided funding to support the peace process. However, there are those who are worried that a Brexit could undermine the Good Friday Agreement, jeopardising peace and stability in Northern Ireland. All in all, a Brexit would create uncertainty on the island of Ireland. What is certain, though, is Ireland's relationship with the UK would be very different. <laughs>